Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a deck review. Hey, today we're gonna look at the Red Wheel playing cards from Dan and Dave, Art of Play, and DKNG. All right, so these cards, they were created in a partnership uh, with Dan and Dave and a graphic design firm called DKNG. Uh, DKNG, they were founded out in 2005, and they're basically a graphic design firm that has handled a lot of the world's foremost artists, entertainers, and uh, companies. Uh, their clients include uh, Oakley, uh, Audi, uh, Jack White. They did some graphics for the new Star Wars Force Awakens film. Uh, it's really pretty cool, and if you wanna check them out, you can visit dkngstudios.com. The inspiration for the Red Wheel deck is, of course, the Red Wheel Bicycle uh, 808 deck. Uh, it's a very iconic deck, and so what DKNG and Dan and Dave want to do is kind of breathe some fresh life into that. So they took some inspiration from the classic bicycle deck, and they uh, are offering you this kind of new updated look. It's a very clean design, uh, it's a very creative design, and there's a lot of personality uh, put into each one of these cards. Front of the tuck ace says US regulation playing cards, and you can see just that red and white familiar color, uh, and it does have that very classic look to it, but I think you'll see some little extra additions like the skulls there on the side. This side says air cushion finish and made in the USA. And this side is a song lyric from Kenny Rogers, know when to hold them and know when to fold them. The bottom has some ad copy about DKNG Studios and Art of Play. And the top says poker and 1984. The tuck seal is a gold foil DKNG skull logo. And you'll notice the inside uh, is all done in that same matte field of red. And then the two tuck flaps have two little tiny skull icons. And the back design, of course, is the back design of the cards. That is pretty much it for the tuck case. Let's take a look at these cards. These cards are printed from the United States Playing Card Company and they do come on their classic retail stock. This is also done with a modern cut and air cushion finish. And if you'd like to learn more about stock cut or finish from the United States Playing Card Company, you can click the link below in the description. The back design, as you can see, uh, carries its namesake. It's a red wheel playing card. You can see the bike design, the bicycle design right there. And also you can see that it is a mirrored image both ways. Um, again, you have that DKNG skull right there. And then you have a couple of red framed borders. With this deck, you're gonna get two full-size jokers. They're both the DKNG skull. Um, and it says Joker down the side. One is a little bit more gold and one is a little bit more yellow gold. With this deck, you're also gonna get two other things. Uh, you're gonna get a replacement card. Um, sometimes uh, back in the day, classic decks used to come with a card like this, where if you lost a card, you could actually use this in its place. So what you would do is you would circle suit and numeric, and then this card would become the card that you misplaced. You're also gonna get a double back add card. So one side is blue and it says Art of Play, and the other side is red and it says DKNG Studios. Your Ace of Spades, like the rest of this deck, has a very Art Deco kind of feel to it. Uh, you'll notice very original uh, font in the corner, as well as brand new pips that have all been kind of spliced down the center, and they are half colored, half gold. Uh, your Ace of Spades has a very small centralized spade pip with the bicycle logo there in the center. All of your court cards have all been redrawn, recolored, and re-inspired for the modern era. Well, that is it for this deck review of the Red Wheel playing cards. If you'd like to purchase your own, you can find them at danandave.com and artofplay.com. That is it for this deck review. As always, we recommend that you like this video just so other people can find it faster. We also recommend that you subscribe to this channel just to stay up to date on the latest in cards and card magic. Now, if you want to follow me on social media, you can. I'm at facebook.com slash magic orthodoxy, twitter.com slash magic orthodoxy, and instagram.com slash magic underscore orthodoxy. Thanks. Bye.